Hello Leo, hope you're all doing well. Thank you for all your likes, shares and subscribes and welcome to the channel. We have no, an emphatic no. I don't know what this is about, we'll see. You might already know what that means. Hold your vision. So stay focused on what you're trying to achieve here, fixed moon. Conclusions are within reach, full moon eclipse. So things are coming to a head. Conclusions, things are going to wrap up. We'll see what all this is about. So no to being distracted off your own path here. It's holding your vision. So don't be distracted about what it is that you're wanting to achieve. The high priestess, the chariot, the magician. Yeah, what it is you're trying to manifest here. The King of Wands, the central energy is the Fool, and the King of Pentacles. We have the Ace of Wands, King of Swords, and the Justice card. Okay, so what we have here, this is about holding your vision, it's about staying the course and staying focused on what it is that you're wanting to achieve, because things are going to come to a conclusion now. And there's going to be brand new opportunities for creation here. So new opportunities coming in. If there's anything that you have wanted to create, um, use your skills, develop a new skill. Uh, we have got the King of Wands here. So this could be an entrepreneur energy, an opportunity to, you know, start up your own business, develop a skill that you already have. If you're artistic, you could use your music and prosper in that sense. Um, whatever it is that you're wanting to create. You could be paint, a painter, you could be wanting to sell your paintings. So things are wrapping up now and it's time to bring in new opportunities and new goals. So there's new things that you could start to learn. You could go on a study course, develop it, you know, in that sense. But what it is, is about manifestation. And what Spirit's saying here is that everything is aligned now for your manifestations to come to fruition. So it's time to think about what you're creating here, the new opportunities you want to take up. Uh, there's been a conclusion to certain parts or certain things in your life. And this is about you having that entrepreneur type energy, being very creative. He's very focused on what he's and he's doing things he enjoys. Therefore, he's growing and creating in that way. So beautiful goals here to be set, new opportunities coming in. Uh, use your intuition here. Um, whatever it is you're passionate about. Your intuition is correct. Always connect in with yourself if there's any doubts, because this is about taking a leap of faith forward. Now, you're trusting in yourself and your journey, having the confidence to go forward. Something you've always wanted to do, it could be something that you've wanted to do from childhood and you've never had the opportunity to do it. What Spirit's saying is, now is the time, whatever it may be for you. And it's about taking the leap of faith and starting from ground zero. So, Leaving behind, when we're talking about conclusions are within reach, it could be working your notice because you're going on a new course. It could be working your notice because you're creating a new company for yourself. Whatever it is that you want to create, it's time to take that leap of faith. And he travels very lightly. He doesn't take his burdens with him. So all his challenges are left behind. Things are all wrapped up now. He's on a brand new journey. Uh, he's listening to his intuition and it's given him the confidence to go forward. Now, your intuition is what you feel, think and you're experiencing. So your gut voice, your gut feeling, it's always correct. It never lets you down. It's real. So whatever you're thinking, feeling or experiencing somewhere, and it may be that you're in an environment where things need to wrap up in that sense, if you're at that stage and you need to take up new opportunities. So it could be either way. Um, you know, it could be the stage that you're needing to learn and listen to what you need to create and take that leap of faith in that sense to go forward. So if you're feeling, for example, that you're you're not achieving in your um, job environment, that will be correct. Follow your intuition and take that leap of faith to move on. Because when we do that, we move very, very quickly towards what it is that we want to bring in here and what we can, what we're passionate about will come forward. Now, he's the chariot. He's very fast moving energy. It'll happen very quickly. So when you take that first step, things start to move and they start to go and move and go. you go in the right, down the right path. Now, he's no reins because he knows exactly where he wants to go because he's manifesting it. He's putting it out to the universe. He's setting his goals. He's staying with it and he's prepared to move forward and take that leap of faith. Now, this could be you starting to see the clarity 
and it could be you communicating what it is you want. So it could be putting in your notice at your work. Um, it could be you've listened to your intuition and it's gave you the clarity you need and you're ready to go. So communicating in that sense, or you could be starting to see clearly what it is that you want to bring in for yourself that's going to be best for you. Now, this could also be a legal situation that comes to fruition here. Uh, it could be a lawyer. Uh, things are going in your favour, so conclusions are within reach. Legal situations, uh, you know, coming to a conclusion. Um, and things are going in your favour here. So that's going to enable you to go forward now. You're ready to go forward and move towards creating something new for yourself in that sense. Now, this could also be, because uh, this could be a lawyer, it could be any information coming forward from any professional person that's going to help you move towards what it is you want. So it could be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius energy, or it could be somebody telling you how they feel about you. Because there's an opportunity for passionate new beginnings here. So it could be somebody who's intellectual, who's very clear headed, who sees you, is passionate about you and is coming forward with information that's going to start you on a new journey. Now, it could be, like I say, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius energy, or this could be um, Aries, Leo or Sagittarius energy, but it doesn't have to be. Now, this is also about karmic justice coming in if it's not a legal situation. When we're manifesting and we set our goals, and we're prepared to take the leap of faith and move towards them, things start to go in our favour. And when there's new goals we want to bring in, then, and you're prepared to go along with it and stick with it, things start to fall into place and karmic justice can have a hand. So the universe will help you go towards what it is you want to create. And it's bringing great balance to your life and fairness. So if there's a legal situation, it's a fair outcome for everybody involved. Um, it's justice in that sense. And what's going to happen is it's going to bring great stability to your life. So whatever it is that you want to manifest, whatever it is you want to create, take up, you know, do for yourself, it's going to bring great stability. Now, he's the Queen of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, and he can sit back and he's enjoying the fruits of his labour. So he's great. This, this new manifestation, this new opportunity, whatever he's manifested here and is prepared to take the leap of faith towards, has brought him great financial security. So... It could be that you're developing a skill, you're going to work for a company and you can end up like a boss type figure. Or like I say, if you've got a hobby or a business you want to invest in, it's going to bring you great financial security for the future. Um, he's created an empire here. Um, he's got good stability within his home life and good working relationships. It could be an established business, like I say. Uh, but beautiful security is definitely on the horizon here. So manifesting, uh, manifesting goals and Sticking with them definitely brings its rewards. Passion. Passion isn't confined to sexual energy. Life is meant to be felt and don't hold back. What it is that you want to create, what you're passionate about here, definitely. Time. Time. The universe is helping you. Look for synchronistic events around you. Now, this could be repeating numbers. It could be repeating songs. If there's master numbers that keep appearing, please look it up meaning of them because spirit is trying to give you an extra message. It could be cats crossing your path, feathers, leaves falling at your feet, whatever it may be. It's spirit letting you know that they're around. I hope this helps Leo. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.